Good morning, Southwest Florida. This is the Naples Herald Morning Report. I'm Janelle Simmons. Today we have to update our sun passes, Donald Trump ready to spend some money, and more. Today is Thursday, December 31st, and this is the Morning Report. In addition to updating their calendars to match the new year, Florida drivers are running out of time to update their sun passes to match state requirements. As of January 1st, battery-operated sun pass transponders will no longer work on tollway roads. As inconvenient as the switch may seem, the rationale behind the technology swap is solid. Congress wants all toll roads to be able to accept transponders from any state. To get in line with the government's requirements, Florida officials are making sure every SunPass customer has a transponder with the correct technology. If you want to learn more, go to Tara Brown's story. The necropsy results for Aussie American Bald Eagle and Internet Sensation from the Southwest Florida Eagle Cam were revealed. The necropsy was performed by Southeastern Cooperative Wildlife Disease Study. According to the report, it does look like Aussie was done in by wounds from fighting another male bald eagle. The wounds festered and allowed bacteria to enter Aussie's bloodstream, which had infected most of his major organs, leaving too little time to treat such a widespread infection. The full report is on Naples Herald. Billionaire Republican presidential candidate Donald Trump says he plans to spend at least $2 million a week on television advertising in the first three voting states, a move that would mark a massive departure for a candidate who has so far relied on free media to fuel his insurgent campaign. While Trump said he's willing to spend whatever it takes to win the Republican nomination, he has proven a frugal campaigner, putting very little of his own money on the line. While Trump likes to claim he's self-funding his campaign, the vast majority of what he's spent so far has come from donors across the country sending checks or purchasing merchandise from his website. Well, let's see if his plan for saving his wallet for voting season works. That was the Morning Report for today. I'm Janelle Simmons. The Morning Report will air next Monday at 8 a.m. Thank you for watching and have a safe and happy new year.